Hi, welcome to our second episode of Absolutely Business, Entrepreneur, Stories. In this episode we will see the history of SpaceX, a company that has revolutionized the aerospace industry and brought us closer to the stars than ever before. In 2001, Elon Musk purchased a seat on the board of the Mars Society, a non-profit organization advocating Mars exploration. With his interest in colonizing the Red Planet, Musk proposed a mission to establish an interplanetary greenhouse. He moved forward with his project with his contact Jim Cantrell. Together alongside aerospace consultant Michael Griffin, they traveled to Russia to acquire an intercontinental ballistic missile, ICBM. However, the Russians would not sell him one, so he decided to build one of his own. Using his deep knowledge of software technology and economics, Musk set out to build a rocket cheaper than any in the industry. He sold his companies PayPal and Zip2 for nearly $2 billion and in 2002, SpaceX was founded by entrepreneur Elon Musk. SpaceX had a simple goal, to reduce the cost of space transportation and make it possible for humanity to colonize Mars. Musk envisioned a world where reusable rockets would make space travel more affordable and accessible, and he set out to make it a reality. With help from Griffin, who had become NASA's administrator in 2005, SpaceX funded their first rocket, the Falcon 1. Despite a shaky start, the rocket reached orbit in 2008, earning the spaceflight company regular contracts. In March of 2006, SpaceX made its first successful launch of the Falcon 1 rocket. While the mission did not reach orbit, it demonstrated the capabilities of the company's first launch vehicle and was a major milestone for the young company. In 2008, SpaceX made history as the first privately funded company to send a spacecraft, the Falcon 1, to orbit. This was a major milestone and a sign of things to come. But SpaceX didn't stop there. They continued to develop more powerful rockets, such as the Falcon 9 and Falcon Heavy. These reusable rockets have been used to launch satellites and spacecraft into orbit at a fraction of the cost of traditional methods. In 2012, SpaceX made another historic achievement as the first privately developed spacecraft, the Dragon, was carried to the International Space Station ISS, by a Falcon 9 rocket. Since then, the Dragon has been regularly used to deliver cargo to the ISS and is being developed to carry humans as well. In December of 2015, SpaceX made another significant achievement by successfully landing the first stage of a Falcon 9 rocket, a reusable booster, after it had sent 11 commercial satellites into orbit. This was the first time a rocket had successfully landed after a orbital launch and started a new chapter in space industry, enabling SpaceX to reuse these boosters, decreasing the cost of launches. In 2018, SpaceX launched the Falcon Heavy, the most powerful rocket in operation at the time, and successfully landed all three of its reusable first-stage boosters. This showed the world the potential for reusable rockets and the cost savings that come with it. Also in 2018, SpaceX began testing its Starship prototype, a fully reusable spacecraft designed for missions to Earth orbit, the Moon, and Mars. After several failed test launches, in 2021, Starship SN15 performed a successful vertical landing, marking the first time a Starship prototype successfully landed, and it was considered a major step for SpaceX towards Mars missions. How does SpaceX make money? SpaceX has several different revenue streams. Communication companies, there are a lot of communication companies that want to send satellites into space. For many years, these companies could only use services by government agencies to get their satellites up in space and SpaceX has given them a cost-effective alternative. SpaceX is able to generate a revenue of $62 million and a net profit of $12 million per launch. The company has been averaging between 20 to 50 launches per year. Government Satellites SpaceX has signed several contracts with the Pentagon wherein it is making missile tracking satellites that will be used for the national defense. SpaceX is able to generate a handsome profit margin on these contracts as well. This is what makes government contracts an attractive alternative source of revenue. Reusable rockets, SpaceX has created rockets that can be reused seven times. 
Hence, even if SpaceX offers steep discounts to their customers for using secondhand rockets, they can still increase their profitability a lot by using these reusable rockets. Satellite-based internet, the star in SpaceX's portfolio is a project called Starlink. SpaceX plans to use deploy several satellites in space with the objective of providing high-speed internet connectivity to the world. And is planning to use space technology to change the face of the telecommunication industry. Morgan Stanley has estimated that this business itself is likely to be worth $52 billion. Space tourism, Elon Musk's SpaceX has also started another line of business aimed at promoting space tourism. Right now SpaceX is charging more than $20 million per person for their space tourism program. However, the company plans to reduce the cost exponentially over time so that such travel is affordable for the upper middle class as well. What are the most important inventions from SpaceX? Reusable rockets. Before 2011, when SpaceX announced its reusable launch system development program, the idea of reusable rockets had been abandoned in the industry. It took SpaceX four years to develop a vertical landing system for its first stages. Before they passed beyond Earth's atmosphere, the equipment would activate propulsion mechanisms to reorient and begin the descent. After the successful first stage recovery, SpaceX could offer its rockets at a 10% discount. SpaceX plans to take this technology even further. Their newest rocket, Starship, will have a reusable second stage, which is considerably harder to build than a first stage because it travels at orbital velocity. The rocket will allow space personnel to land on the Moon and Mars and return to Earth in good condition. Methalox Rocket Engines Its Merlin rocket is capable of a thrust-to-weight ratio of 150 to 1, the highest in the industry. However, the spaceflight company has taken its rocket engines into unexplored territory. The rocket manufacturer needed an engine powerful enough to launch Starship, nearly twice the size of the Falcon 9. To do this, they diverted from traditional kerosene engines and built a full-flow methane one. The Raptor engine ignites all of its propellant to spin its turbine as fast as possible. The new engine is capable of 2.2 mn, nearly four times the strength of its predecessor. SpaceX Acquisitions Swarm Technologies SpaceX purchased Swarm Technologies, a private communications company, for around $85 million in 2021. The company is the developer of the smallest satellites in space, owning a constellation of about 120 alongside ground equipment. It is unclear what SpaceX plans to do with Swarm, but it works alongside the spaceflight company's Starlink product. What's the future of SpaceX? SpaceX's future looks quite ambitious and exciting, with a number of planned missions and projects that have the potential to change the way we think about space travel and the possibilities that lie beyond our planet. One of the most significant projects currently underway at SpaceX is Starlink. This program aims to provide high-speed internet to remote and underserved areas via a network of low-Earth orbit satellites. SpaceX has already launched hundreds of satellites into orbit, and the company plans to launch thousands more in the coming years, providing global internet coverage. Another major project for SpaceX is the development of the Crew Dragon spacecraft. This spacecraft is designed to carry humans to the International Space Station ISS, and other destinations. SpaceX has already conducted several successful test flights of the Crew Dragon and has plans to send humans to the ISS in the near future, making space travel more accessible. One of the most ambitious projects is the Starship, a fully reusable spacecraft designed for missions to Earth orbit, the Moon, and Mars. SpaceX is currently developing and testing the prototype, with the aim of launching it to Earth orbit in the near future and later on transporting people to Mars and other celestial bodies. SpaceX is also working on the development of reusable rockets with the goal of decreasing the cost of launches, it has already landed and reused multiple of its Falcon 9 and Falcon Heavy first stages, and the company plans to continue to do so with future rockets. Additionally, SpaceX plans to launch satellites for customers using its reusable rockets. This would offer an alternative to traditional launch methods and make access to space more affordable for a wide range of customers. 
With all these plans for the future, one thing is clear, SpaceX is leading the way in the space industry and pushing the boundaries of what is possible. The company's innovative reusable technology, ambitious plans, and drive for success make it a key player in the space industry for years to come. Today, SpaceX is one of the most successful private spaceflight companies, with a number of successful launches and landings under its belt. The company has several planned future missions, including the launch of a privately crewed Dragon spacecraft to the ISS and the launch of the first humans on a mission to Mars in the coming decade. Thanks for watching this story and I hope you enjoyed the history of SpaceX and its creator Elon Musk. If you liked the video, don't forget to give it a like and subscribe to help this channel grow. Absolutely, inspiring business and entrepreneur stories. So, what's your story?